Whether it's on stage, the small screen, or the big screen, Mr. B.D. Wong delivers all kinds of greatness. Now he's giving us a double dose of talent on Aquafina is Nora from Queens. And it's not just in front of the camera, but also behind the scenes. Action. The kids in the neighborhood used to play pickup games in the park. But I never got paid. Robert? Michael S? Michael P? Michael R? Mikey D? It was brutal. Waiting. I felt like everybody got picked except me. Hey, I'm over here. A kid with a broken arm is total nerd. Seriously? That door kiss over me? One kid just wearing a suit. You. I and know, right? Please welcome back to the Pixel Level News, actor, director, Tony Award winner, Mr. B.D. Wong! Oh, my gosh. Good morning. Hello. Hi, everybody. Uh, we're all Thanks, laughing man. out loud at that clip, and I'm saying this is just a hilarious show. Oh, and Judy Gold and I were talking about you earlier this week because you were on oh her show, and she's on the second season of Aquafina. Nora is Aquafina from Queens. Yes, she is. Right? Yes, an old, a really old good friend. Right. Really, somebody that I just, uh, uh, just love to uh, death. All right. Yeah. So speaking of something and someone we just love, this show is such a gift. Like everyone from Wally, Nora, Edmund, Grandma, Brenda, Shushu, and those who saw the first <laughs> season know that Grandma shares her backstory. Now it's your turn, and we get to see little yes. Wally played by a familiar face, which is the clip we just saw. Yes, yes, yes. Alan Kim from the movie Minari, and he was just wonderful. And it was just a, a real kick to uh, not only have him play the role of m younger me, like seven-year-old me, but also to kind of direct him in the in the in the scenes and in the show. That it really was a an ex experience that I r really am grateful and and excited to have had. I had put off kind of wanting to be a, an episodic director, but this this family that I joined, uh, you know, two seasons ago in Nora from Queens, really made it easy for me and really made it fun, and I really enjoyed it a, a whole lot. It's a really whole different level of storytelling to be involved as the director. Well, because you have directed on stage before, but this is your TV yes. directorial debut, so I want to clarify yes. that. But it's a co yes. two completely different worlds because you're not yelling yeah, action I mean, I, on I've, stage. I've, Yes, that's right. It's and and it's really complicated by the fact that you're you're an actor in the, the exactly. piece too. It's really much easier when you're not in the scenes and you can kind of deal as an actor to the uh, to the other to, with the other actors that you already know because you work on the show with them. But then when you're as soon as you're in the scene, it becomes a whole other very complicated, a very very confused confusing kind of situation which is really fun yeah. and challenging but it, it, it really it, it really causes you to really have to be on your toes All you're right. watching at the same time that you're trying to do it and trying to figure out how you're going to make acting choices at the same time really complicated if anyone can handle it it's you mr wong it is you <laughs> oh and before i forget i have to congratulate you because your TV daughter, your princess, Grandma's Bao Bao, and Garbage Boy <laughs> are killing it right now at the box office. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Breaking records it, with Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten yeah, Rings. Yeah. Marvel's first Asian superhero. Are you kidding me? And they're all part of your uh, Nora family on Comedy Central. They, yes, they are. All of them. You know, Simu play, did come on and play Garbage Boy in the yeah. season one, and, 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 and the two of them are, are, are very tight and very very good friends and 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 i think um it, it's just wonderful as a member of the asian american community to see this kind of exposure and representation in such a positive way they, they really are killing it it's really an excellent movie i have nothing to do with the movie except to, to to tell people go and see it because it's just really really a joyful experience for asian americans right now and it's your they're your family members anyway so yeah that's what you yeah. have to do with the movie they're your family members and speaking of breaking yes. records the jurassic movies are pros at doing that and you have dominion coming up and you also play doctor, you're gonna play Dr. Wu again. And I feel you've played so many doctors, you can prescribe and, and diagnose um, stuff at this point. Oh my gosh. Have Actually, you not? Yes, I almost. Uh, no, but people ask me all the time, you know, for advice and stuff like that. <laughs> and it's hilarious because I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. But uh, but I have done that. You know, I, I used to get to the point where I would walk to a, a wardrobe fitting and I would just dread that there would be a lab coat hanging on the on the rack because I thought, oh my gosh, another lab coat. Here we go. But, you know, uh, that's. It's all part of a whole kind of uh, career, kind of um, a journey, right? Yeah. And this character has really come a long way yep. over almost, you know, 25, 30 years mm -hmm. uh, to play the same part over four different movies it, over such a, a, a big part of your life is, is really rare, really, really rare. So, and to see the, 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 uh, the filmmakers taking the character in different directions and, and letting them have his, 
say and his do is really, really nice. Well, and that comes out next summer in 2022. And it really is huge. It's a very epic final chapter to the Jurassic uh, uh, franchise, to the, to the Jurassic World uh, trilogy. Well, we don't care if you're wearing a, a doctor lab coat or whatever it is. We'll come see whatever it is you're serving up. And we're going to, because you always deliver. We thank you so much for always joining us on the Pix Level Morning News. We cannot wait to see you in front and behind the camera next Thursday night on Okafina is Nora from Queens on Comedy Central. Wednesday. If you haven't seen season yes. one, make sure you see it. It's, it's streaming on HBO Max right now. Thank you so much. Yes, you said yes, Wednesday yes. night? Wednesday at 10, Wednesday yes, night. on Comedy Central. Yes, thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank Have you a good so day, much. sir.